So today we're just going to do a quick video, uh, talk about two different things. Number one, the bad reviews of Dr. Golpa's offices and the cost, what the actual cost is and where you can find it and see if they really are transparent. All right, so there's a couple Golpa groups that I'm in and I see two things all the time. People saying, where's the bad reviews and the cost? Uh, so let's talk about the bad reviews first. So I made this really easy for you all. I found the bad reviews and here they are. All right, so our first review is from Travis. It's from six years ago. Uh, basically, six years ago, he went to Dr. Golpa in Vegas. Um, that was the only office he had opened at that time, as far as I know. Uh, he went there in January. He had pain when he left on the left side, which that's gonna happen. If you look at my other video, you're gonna see that there is pain involved. It's, you know, you're, you're literally getting implants drilled into your bone. And if you think it's gonna be painless, probably not. I mean, I guess for some people it probably is, but that's beside the point. So three months goes by, he goes back to Dr. Gulpa's office and they tell him supposedly that the implants are loose and they're not long enough. As far as the looseness goes, I can't comment on that. I have no idea. My guess, as far as the uh, length goes, I'm gonna say that he still has some swelling because it's only three months out and they were going to loosen up the bridges so that would make him come up a little bit more uh, so there's not so much pressure and that would relieve some pain. When they went to do that, most likely, uh, the implants were not long enough to back him up. So they probably told him, you know, switch salt water uh, and some other things to do to get the swelling down and to stop the pain. Uh, and then that was it. There's literally nothing else they can do at that point. He goes on to say that Dr. Golpa, like all other doctors, are money hungry and the only thing they have to lose is their reputation. And that's where they're wrong. All right, so I don't know. Maybe that's just a bad review. Maybe Dr. Golpa six years ago was terrible. I don't know. So let's go to the next one. So three years ago, T. Wood called one of the offices to do his phone consult. And basically he had his checkbook in hand and they never called him back. Well, here's why, T. Wood. Uh, so they're not gonna pressure you into that. Have you ever filled out like a form on a car dealership website? You know how you get a million phone calls from that point on saying, are you ready to buy yet? Is that not annoying? Yeah, it is. So that's why they don't. They're never gonna do that. Uh, if they do, I would really be shocked because they're not gonna pressure you or torment you to get this done. Um, that's just how they roll. All right, next up, we got John Doe from three years ago. John Doe says, highway robbery, 40K for one day's work. Really? How come in Poland it's only 8,000? And in greedy USA, it's 40K. Greed is all it is. Well, John, lucky for you, I like numbers. So I've done the math. So here are the estimated expenses with the sources above. Uh, Golpa's cost is $872,000. Poland is at $215,000. Now, look at this. So at $33,500 for each procedure, it would still take 27 procedures for Dr. Golpa to break even at one office. But in Poland, it would take 27 procedures as well. So you gotta look at the cost of things here compared to the cost of things there, including the office's expenses. All right, so the cost is really transparent there's nothing to hide however it is a little confusing on gulpa's website all right so if you go to uh dr gulpa's website you'll see the cost tab up here uh oddly enough it is not listed there uh yeah the cost not being on the cost webpage but it's all good maybe there was a mistake somewhere so go over to the g4 advantage click on restoration options and if you scroll down you'll see the uh different options you got with Dr. Gulpa. You got the PMMA, which is what I have. Uh, then you have the Nano Ceramic. Nano is a little bit more expensive, and here are some of the reasons why. It does a whole lot more. Uh, this is what you know most other dentists give you right there. Uh, and then just scroll down, and there are the prices. Uh, you've got the PMMA, which start out at 33.5, and then the Nano starts out at 39.5. Now, there are other fees that can come into play, like if you need a bone graft, if you need 
extra implants or whatever the case may be. Uh, but they're really upfront. They'll tell you before everything starts. That way you know, you know how much you got to show out for everything. All right, so that's that. Uh, be sure to subscribe and do all the other things that everybody tells you to do on YouTube. Tomorrow, I have another video coming out that is talking about the things that you should know or it's just some tips and advice and things that I think you should know. It's eight great tips and stuff. So yeah, come back tomorrow at whatever time it's posted. See y'all later. <laughs>